Hello you guys, it's me Robin. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. So this is part two of questions, fitness questions that you guys have asked me. Um, obviously I literally just filmed part one and yeah, let's just get straight into this. But before we do, I'd just like to say, please do check out my other channels because I do have four YouTube channels, can be crazy. Um, but I have my main channel, Robin Emily. This channel is obviously Robin Emily Fitness. Then I have Robin Emily Travel and Robin Emily Gaming. So yeah, definitely make sure to check them all out. And yeah, let's just get straight in with this video. So the first question I was asked is, um, what is your least favorite workout to do in the gym? And I didn't actually think of an answer for this. Let me think. Oh, okay, absolutely, definitely squats. And I feel like a lot of girls say that's their favorite, but oh my God, how painful and awful and i don't actually feel like they actually give you any results like i would say absolutely anyone who's like looking for glutes workouts just ignore squats and focus on rdls and um like bulgarian split squats because honestly awful i hate squats so yeah that's my least favorite workout um the next question was how to not be scared about being judged so i assume that's like in the gym specific rather than just in general um i don't know i've never really cared I, my gym's very heavily why are you just standing there waiting am i in the footage your head is not in it why are you upside down because my camera's broken um so my gym's like literally all like 40 year old men and they kind of get on with their life and yeah i've never really felt like they're the kind of people to judge i feel like if you're in a gym with a lot of like students like my uni gym is a bit more judgy um people do like film in there and stuff um and it's a lot more people like obviously my kind of age so i feel like i would be more likely to judge I feel like I'd be more likely to like worry about that there, but I don't know, I've never really worried about that. I don't know how to not be scared about it. Just realize that everyone had to start somewhere. So everyone has been in the position that you've been in now and everyone has been scared about it in the past. Um, but yeah, I don't I think that's something really to worry about. So the next question I had was, do you do cardio? And this is like different depending on the time of year. So in summer, I try to do a bit more cardio just like leading up to like a holiday. So I was running 1K a, a day for like three weeks leading up to my holiday. Um, and I did notice difference. I definitely lost a bit of fat, um, but I haven't continued to do that and I don't really care too much to continue to do that. Um, I don't enjoy cardio, I hate it. Sometimes I went through a phase of doing five minutes on the Stairmaster after every session and then eventually that became 15 minutes. And then I realized how boring the Stairmaster actually is and I just can't be asked to do that after every single workout. So I stopped doing that. So no, I mean, I don't really do cardio unless I've got like something big coming up um, where I'd wanna be a bit leaner. Um, right, the next question is, do you drink a lot? So I'm assuming this means alcohol and not like water. Um, not really. So yeah, yeah. do I drink a lot? No, I mean, when I'm at uni, I drink probably like a few drinks a week, all on the same night. But other than that, like if I'm not going out, I'm not drinking at home. Um, if I'm at like on holiday at a festival, obviously I'll drink every night. Um, but no, I don't like drink a lot at all. I would say I don't actually make an effort to keep that on a low either because I know alcohol is a lot of calories, but it doesn't really bother me. I don't track my calories anyway. So yeah, if you want to drink to have a good time, go for it. Do so you do you train abs? No, I think that's quite clear. Um, I never have, never really will. Oh no, I have actually. So when I broke my wrist last year, I was doing a three day split and the first day was quads and hamstrings. The second day was core and cardio. And then the third day was calves and I don't know actually. Calves and, I can't remember what I did. So I think I did quads and hamstrings and then glutes and calves maybe. But obviously you can't really do much when you've got a broken wrist because you can't lift any weights or anything. So I was doing core a lot and it was so boring. Um, I'll insert some videos on the screen. Oh my God, I was so bored. And also I couldn't drive when I'd just broken my wrist. So I had to go to the gym with my mum. So she would go for like an hour 
hour and a quarter and I'd just be sat there training core for like an hour and then walking on a treadmill which you can't even walk that quickly on because I constantly had a fear of falling over um but yeah I don't train abs now because it's boring and yeah boring basically so yeah that is the little q a thank you guys for sending in some questions and if you have any other questions leave them in the comments and then i'll make another part to this video or a whole new video um but yeah thank you so much for watching guys i hope you have enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one adios No time for me. I've been flying from town to town.